Hello! Today we review the new grease pencil features in Blender 3.5, the first Blender release in 2023. In this release we get 5 new or improved operators, 5 improvements to the user interface, 2 modifiers getting new powerful modes, and as a bonus, one native add-on gets great new features. Before we start, please consider checking my Gumroad, there are some free and some paid files there and everything is connected to free tutorials on this channel. During this video, I will mention some resources that you can find in the top right or the description. Operators 1. Sculpt mode auto masking moved from being a brush setting to a global sculpt setting. This way you don't have to edit it for every brush. 2. New layer and material options were added to auto masking and the old ones were renamed active layer and active material. The active options mean that brushes will affect only strokes in the active layer or using the active material. The other options affect the strokes that are under the cursor and all strokes that have the same layer or material depending on the options you tick. The more options you tick, the more restricted the sculpting will be. It can be confusing and that's why I uploaded a dedicated video that goes slowly exploring what combinations of these options do. 3. A new pie menu was added to summon all auto masking options with the shortcut Shift plus Alt plus A. 4. Interpolate sequence that creates interpolated keyframes between two spaced grease pencil keyframes works now even if one of those extremity keyframes is of the breakdown type, the blue ones. Previously, blue keyframes were ignored in interpolations, but now they are treated by default like any other keyframe type. A new option was added in the last operation menu to revert to the old behavior by excluding breakdowns. 5. Copying and pasting strokes works now in multi-frame mode. This allows copying strokes from multiple frames and or pasting them to multiple frames. The copying is done from selected grease pencil keyframes and the pasting happens in selected keyframes plus the frames that the playhead is on. If the playhead is on a blank frame and auto keying is enabled, a new keyframe will be created there with the pasted data. If auto keying is disabled, it will be pasted in the previous keyframe. Multi-frame copy paste makes it easier to paste a new detail to multiple frames and allows taking strokes from multiple frames to use them as a smear effect, for example. As in these examples by Grease Pencil developer Frogstomp. User interface 1. Vertex opacity is a setting under the overlays menu that adjusts the vertex and strokes display in edit, weight paint and sculpt mode. Before it was accessible only from edit mode, now you can tweak it from sculpt mode too, but not yet from weight paint mode. 2. When display cursor is enabled in draw mode, now you can see a circle that reflects the brush size. 3. While resizing a brush using the F key, now the circle that appears reflects the correct brush size. 4. The material popover used to display only stroke colors, but now it displays fill and or stroke colors depending on which are enabled in the selected material and if they use a solid color. 5. Creating a new layer using the Y key in viewport allows giving it a name. If you have enabled the native grease pencil tools add-on, and I don't see why you wouldn't, you will lose the naming ability. But in exchange get a very powerful layer navigator that allows hiding, locking, reordering layers, changing their opacity and more. I made a dedicated video explaining all what the grease pencil tools add-on with its new features can do to simplify your life. Modifiers 1. Offset by stroke, layer or material options were added to the offset modifier. This allows creating some cool visuals using location, scale and rotation to add offset between different strokes, layers or materials. In this example, I changed the offset mode under advanced to stroke, add an X location offset of minus 6. Now see when I draw strokes in the right side that every new stroke will push the previous ones to the left. Frogstomp who developed this feature explores more of its effects and use cases in a video. 2. 
New natural drawing speed mode was added to the build modifier. This will take into account the time in which each vertex was created to build lines with the same rate they were drawn with. One in speed factor plays the building animation at the recorded speed. More than one is faster and less is slower. Maximum gap decides the maximum pause time between strokes. This makes sure there are not excessive delays, especially if you drew your strokes with long pauses in between. Mark Shihab, the feature developer, explains in a video why Grease Pencil is a powerful educational video making tool, especially with the addition of natural drawing. This is it for the new Grease Pencil goodies in Blender 3.5. Leave a like, subscribe, and let's meet again in another video. Peace.